Hi, in this video I'll be showing you how you can remove noise and echo from your audio. So what you have to do first is you have to record the room tone. As you can see, to 5 to 10 seconds. After you have done the recording, you can select that noise area. And then go to FX, noise reduction, and capture noise. So the noise data has been captured. After doing that, you can go to FX, noise reduction, and noise reduction process. So make sure that you have this green and yellow line as close as possible. And you can leave this spectral decay rate as 1%, precision factor, everything as shown in this. Select the settings. You can select on select entire file and then go to apply. So now the noise is removed. Hi, this is a sound check. Hi, this is a sound check to remove echo. Now what you have to do is you have to remove the echo. So you can do this by applying a parametric equalizer. But that is the hard way. So the better is to use a plugin. I use a plugin called Deverberate. I will leave the link in the comments below. So after you have done downloading the plugin, you can go to FX, go to the audio plugin manager, then scan for the plugins, then it will appear here. It's called Deverberate. Then you can click on OK. After doing that, you can go to the FX and it will come under this VST3 Restoration Econ Digital Econ Digital Deverberate. So, what is the good thing about this plugin is that it already has presets available. So, you can select Reduce Room Reverb to sitting in a room hall. So, I found that the Reduce Room Reverb is very effective. You can select that, you can play. Hi, this is a sound check. Let's play through that. Hi, this is a sound check. 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 You can click on apply. And the echo is reduced. Hi, this is a sound check to remove echo. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe to the channel. See you in the next video.